Well, here's a hot take on a recent, much quoted interview. I would submit that the idea that it's easy to be the best military in the world when you can get onto a radio and call an airstrike to destroy a motor position only addresses part of the issue. What is not easy is getting to the point where you've managed to integrate all arms and branches correctly so that when anybody on the front line asks for air or artillery or fuel or medevac or whatever, that it actually shows up. And it takes an awful lot of work and training to get to that point. And if it were that easy, any military will be doing it. And it's not just a matter of throwing kit at the problem. Ask the Russians. It requires the correct distribution of resources and good staff work by folks operating under good doctrine in order to make it happen efficiently. And this isn't a US only thing. I would expect smaller nations like France or the UK to be equally as responsive to frontline needs where resources are appropriately apportioned and trained. So just wanted to put that out there.